we have finally received official news on a new Bleach game called Bleach Rebirth of Souls. The other day Shueisha has trademarked the name Bleach Rebirth of Souls in Europe, which means there is a Bleach game in development for sure. Now I know not all of you know what this means, but the short explanation is that Shueisha has started the process to reserve the rights to use the name Bleach Rebirth of Souls, an upcoming game, which means if another company decides to contest the claim, they will have to go to court and pay and yeah, this part is confusing, so just be content with the explanation of them reserving a name. Just as a side note, even though this is official, this is not a leak, this still doesn't confirm that the game will release at all, since there has been a few times when trademark games got scrapped, but I don't recall ever hearing about an anime game getting trademarked and then getting cancelled. We don't know what type of game this is going to be, but knowing that a Bleach mobile game is already in the works, which recently had a closed beta testing, it's safe to assume that this game is not primarily being made for mobile phones. We do know, however, that Hiroshi Matsuyama, the CEO of CyberConnect2, has multiple times stated that they would love to make a Bleach game, which is still not a confirmation for them being the developers, but I wouldn't be surprised if they got the rights. Now if it turns out that CC2 is the developer for a new Bleach game, then that means this game will be either an arena fighter or a story mode only game. CC2 makes excellent story mode games with top tier visuals and audio work, however if it turns out that this is an arena fighter then I have doubts after half Naruto Storm connections dropped. CC2 online games are infamous of missing core features such as friend invite, spectator mode, the tournament mode, group matches, just to name some, and seeing as we are soon entering 2024, it is gonna be even more dissatisfying to get a game with these things missing day one. You can only launch a game once, therefore the lack of these features can very well kill the game week one, just like it did with Naruto Storm Connection, but as I have said before, nothing is set in stone, this is just a possibility, hence why I am already voicing my concerns. The trademark is as good as we can get for now, we have yet to receive a trailer or even an official statement, but this is not just your average YouTuber league saying trust me dude it's happening, there is solid evidence. That's gonna be it for today's video guys, there's really not much more to talk about, let me know down in the comments what you think this game will turn out to be, and make sure to voice your concerns just in case the developers find this video, so we can let them know we have had enough of half finished products. I would appreciate if you have subscribed to the channel as well, after all I'm planning to cover future Bleach Rebirth of Souls news the moment they drop, that way none of you will miss out on the latest information. That's it for today's video guys, I hope you all have had a fantastic day, stay safe, and until next time boys. Peace!